This week, legislation sponsored by Senators M. Teresa Ruiz and Paul Sarlo that would authorize over $14 billion in tax incentives to spur economic growth was approved by the Senate. As a Norfer, I have to say, I can testify on the benefit of having incentive programs. If for whatever reason you have any doubt in your mind or you think that these these numbers or these words on paper don't come out to tangible solutions, visit the areas where projects have taken over parking lots that were never utilized for its purpose and now are on our economic rolls that are creating jobs, that are providing affordable housing. This is why this is important. Senator Sarlo added, this legislation will provide tax incentives to attract the jobs we want. Jobs that pay high salaries in cutting edge industries that will transform communities, partner with our higher education sector on R&D, provide valuable job training, and be good corporate citizens. Last week, legislation authored by Senator Joe Cryan, Senate President Steve Sweeney, and Senator Shirley Turner that would provide state funding to outfit police officers in New Jersey with body cameras was approved by the Senate. The bill would provide a supplemental appropriation of $59 million. Senator Sweeney noted, the statewide use of body cams will be a significant step in achieving reforms that improve the criminal justice system and make real progress in social justice. The public and the police are protected by having body cameras. They help safeguard the officers and the citizens they interact with by producing an accurate record of their interactions. A picture is worth a thousand words. This has been the Senate Democrats Week in Review. Happy holidays and thanks for watching.